The Malta US Alumni Association was set up in April 2012. Its members are mainly Maltese participants in the US Exchange Program government. It provides opportunities for networking with other alumni. Its main objective is to organize educational and community projects that highlight key issues being debated in Malta and the USA, such as judicial reform, healthcare reform, educational reform, economic initiatives, substance abuse, border security, and transborder crime, etc. Another objective of the association is to mentor Maltese youths and identify promising future leaders. The association is an ideal medium to maintain the momentum of exchange progress, encouraging constructive dialogue on ways in which to strengthen the bilateral relationship and improve our two communities. Up and coming Maltese with certain qualifications are nominated by the US Embassy to participate in a number of US government exchange programs. All Maltese participants in the International Visitor Leadership Program, the Fulbright Program, the Hubert H. Humphrey Fellowship Program, the Salzburg Seminar Program, and the Benjamin Franklin Transatlantic Fellowship are all eligible for membership. However, under Article 4, Paragraph 2 of the Statute of the Association, the Board of Directors may consider extending membership to other individuals who assist the association financially or who, in the, in the opinion of the association, have made a substantial contribution towards promoting the association's objectives. The first event was organized um, by the association some time ago. It was a meet and greet with US Ambassador Gina Abercrombie Winstanley, during which she spoke about US foreign policy in the Mediterranean. Our next event, um, we are presenting a distinguished American professor, Professor David Schultz, who is an expert on the US presidential elections. I can say that the association is also planning a number of other activities, which will give the alumni the opportunity to meet with high-level American officials from all walks of life. The board of direct directors is committed to ensuring that membership in the multi-US alumni association provides meaningful benefits besides being a prestigious honor. The U.S. Embassy selects potential candidates for the International Visitor Leadership Program. The University of Malta issues an internal call to all its faculty members, inviting them to apply for the Fulbright Program. The Humphrey Fellowship Program and the Benjamin Frank Franklin Transatlantic Fellowship are advertised in the local newspapers and on the U.S. Embassy website. The Salzburg Seminar is open to anyone and we invite interested person, persons to browse its website. There are some very interesting programs on its website. Um, it is http colon two slashes www.salzburgglobal.org slash current slash index dash b dot cfm anyone who is keen on being considered for any one of the above programs should write to the u.s embassy expressing his interest and giving some information on his or her background the u.s embassy is happy to consider potential leaders for all its exchange programs All the costs 
related to participation in the International Visitor Leadership Program, the Humphrey Fellowship Program, the Fulbright Program, and the Benjamin Tra Franklin Transatlantic Fellowship are funded by the Department of State. The participant does not incur any expenses except for personal spending money. However, with regards to the Salzburg Seminar, the participant must fund his own travel expenses, Malta, Salzburg, Malta. This is his or her sole.